Now, I'm sure you guys have seen signs like this at movie theaters, banks, businesses, hospitals, or military bases. Currently, these signs hold very little weight in the state of Florida. A bank may not want you to carry a firearm into the building, but it is not a crime to carry a gun into a bank. Many Floridians consider banks to be federal property. However, they are private businesses that are federally insured. Even though you are allowed to bring a gun into a bank, the bank can refuse service and ask you to leave. If this happens, you must leave the building immediately. If you refuse to go, you could be arrested for armed trespassing, which is a felony. In 2019, my family and I decided to spend the day in Disney Springs. Now, in case you're not familiar, Disney Springs is a free, yeah, you heard that right, free area of Disney that contains restaurants, events, small rides, and gift shops. So it's a fun area that helps me avoid spending hundreds of dollars on the main park with the same effect. One Friday, we were walking and a sheriff's deputy approached me. Are you carrying a firearm, he asked. Yes, I replied. Are you just arriving or are you on your way out, he asked. The officer stated that he and two other officers would have to escort me out of the facility immediately. Now, my family was using the restroom at the time, but the deputy just didn't care. I had to start walking to the exit without my family. If I refused, I could have been arrested for felony armed trespassing. As I was walking my way to the exit, I gave these individuals my Second Amendment violation speech. I knew one thing. As long as I was walking towards the exit and not refusing to leave, there was nothing they could do to me. Now, what about no guns allowed signs at the IRS building? The sign is not what makes possession of a firearm unlawful. It's the federal law that makes it illegal. Now, let's pretend the IRS building did not have a sign. Could you have a gun? No, you cannot. It, because it's not the sign that makes it illegal, it is the federal law that says you are not allowed to have a building at the IRS building.